welcome back to our COVID song launch show on Brimank Live on Live FM. I'm your host, Rashani, and I'm joined by Mikiel. And now we are moving to our set, and we have got Bella here. So Bella, Laurie, and Amy wrote this amazing track, and Bella is here to chat about the show. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. All righty. Bella, first of all, can you tell us a little bit about your in music? Uh, yeah, so um, I've had a bit of a history with music. Um, I grew up um, in, not as, as a musician's family, but I grew up loving music and enjoying mm. like uh, making stuff, like just, you know, random stuff. Um, so yeah, I've gotten piano lessons since I was really young and then I did vocal lessons as well, and uh, um, I did VCE music performance as well, and mm -hmm. now I'm studying um, music performance in uni. Really cool. Amazing, yeah. Um, and so you are you, you do songwriting and you also play instruments as well. You play the piano, mm -hmm. uh, as you've said. Um, and during COVID, I guess how has it's been during the pandemic and how has music helped you during your experiences so COVID was a really weird experience because I was studying year in year 12 and simultaneously stuck in my room or mm -hmm. surrounded by my music stuff so it was it was both um a bit of a challenging thing because I was just in my room most of the time so a lot of the ideas that I usually would have were not really present so I had to think a little differently so yeah I mean <laughs> does that, if that makes sense yeah so um when I was writing my music a lot of the time I'll be writing about what how I felt during COVID and mm. that also and um that kind of thing and I was uh, while also studying so it was really challenging absolutely but at the same time music was kind of like my paradise mm. it was a way for yeah. me to step out of um, where I was in my room and like explore outside of the world as well. If that mm. makes sense. <laughs> like a absolutely, yeah. And I guess that um, you know, during the pandemic, a lot of people had huge stresses that they had to to deal with, and, and you doing year twelve was one of them. Which congratulations, you know, you came out of it and you um, kind of made it through the year. But as you said, music can be a source of escape or paradise for people, and it very much seems like music was that for you. Yeah. yeah. Mm. <laughs> Did you happen to like find out anything new or learn anything new in your music that you didn't know just thanks to like the lockdown and having a lot of time at home? Mm. Yeah. I did quite a lot of experimentation with my music. Um, yep. I usually kept to a bit of a box when I briefly mm. before COVID, but um, because I was having so much time in my room, I had I, I felt the ideas kind of of wanting to maybe experiment a little bit more with what I created. So, mm -hmm. yeah, so there was that element of exploring a little bit more because I had more time. And um, mm. I could do a little bit, a, a bunch more things that I couldn't previously do because of time. So, yeah, that was definitely an aspect of learning more about what I could do and what I could do on my door as well and, like, my composing and my songwriting skills. So that definitely improved. <laughs> yeah. Really. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Um, and can you tell us a little bit about the track that yourself, Laurie and Amy um, put together? What was the process of, of writing the song? So uh, I actually, we had, I had Amy come over and cause she's a guitarist, so she's a whiz at that. So we worked on the song as like, we first began with just the lyrics cause um, I mm -hmm. believe personally lyrics is really important. So we worked on that first. And then once we had like a general idea of what we wanted to talk about, um, we started working on the chords and everything else. So the lyrics came first. And uh, I think mm. the original theme was kind of just talking about how we're stuck at home and how sucky that is, <laughs> like how awful that yeah. is. But then it kind of evolved into like this concept of, um, you know, kind of like the, all the messages 
messages that they would be telling about and how we'd have to like you know wear a mask 1.5 yeah. away that kind of thing and uh, we wanted to include that in the chorus and kind of reinforce the idea of you know even if we're kind of stuck in this and we have to follow all these rules it's for the betterment of being able to come out of this mm. yes. hey we survived <laughs> yeah yeah absolutely and the track is such a vibe I mean it really is the coolest way of putting those messages out of, of wearing a mask and washing your hands um mm. there's also um a little bit that's sung in Spanish which I believe yeah. Amy did tell us a little bit about um what inspired that so um Amy is as you know is Spanish so um originally she didn't want to um sing and but we had to, we wanted to convince her because you know, Australia itself is very multicultural. Mm. And, uh, a lot of the messages that we hear in Australia are very from the English speaking. So, but mm -hmm. we wanted, I especially wanted to push Amy to try and include messages that are from Spanish speaking yeah. because that's awesome. There needs to be more <laughs> languages, yes. other languages and songs, you know. So yeah. I'm actually really happy that Amy build had the courage to do that because I know that she was really really worried about that but mm. Amy if you're listening you did so amazing yes absolutely <laughs> awesome. she sounded yeah. so beautiful you all did but um yeah I think it, it is really important as you said a lot of the messaging um that we've gotten during COVID has been um for English speakers and it's great to have those messages in other languages as well to reach yeah. more people absolutely and also to share stories from other people as well because if you've got yeah. only one side there's not enough to fully understand mm. so, yeah, yeah. Really did um yeah did working with uh emmy and laurie make it easier for you uh, because do you usually like collab with a lot of people or do you usually just do your own thing how was that I... experience working with like emmy and laurie I actually so. really, really enjoyed working with other people because, yeah, yeah, as you say, I work pretty much almost like entirely on my own. So they are, yeah. So it was really, really cool to work with other musicians and collaborate with them. And uh, I learned quite a lot about their process and how they write songs and also how I write songs. So, mm -hmm. and it was really, really cool because we got to blend all of our kind of ideas and all of our ways that we communicate in one song so that's mm. a really beautiful thing I think absolutely like, um, and and were there any differences with how um you all approach songwriting and, and putting and composing a song and putting it all together I think in my case I as I say I usually start with the lyrics yeah. and occasionally I do know like Amy would probably might start with the chords I don't really mm. know I have yeah. to ask her more in depth about that <laughs> but um yeah I think we have like little little things that we do a little like differently yeah um like mm. uh yeah. <laughs> yeah but like I don't know um the chorus was like the hardest part to do and I think that's where we started on and yeah and I think usually I would start with the verse I'm not right. and I'm because like you know and build the story up that way but um we started with the chorus and then we did the lyrics for our individual sections mm. so. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and so do you want to introduce the song to our listeners and we can maybe have a, a listen to it? Yeah, of course. Um, quickly letting you know, uh, we actually named ourselves Lab. So I, have I love that. Really it works perfectly. Mm, yo, <laughs> that's fire. Yes. Jesus. So awesome. It was so cool. So yeah, um, everybody take a listen to our song Stay Together by Lab. Yeah. 
like me staring out windows I leave school on you and walk away nap for the day I know I won't sleep tonight I miss you and my family a bit too much not just but but I'm missing my community me gusta mi Demasiado ahora necesito ayudar No he visto a mi familia en seis meses Pero he visto su sueño a ti y a mí Welcome back to Bremang Live on Live FM. You are listening to the COVID song launch show with Rashani and Mikiel. And we just heard Bella, Laurie and Amy's song, Stay Together. What an incredible track. Um, Bella, can you tell us a little bit about any projects that you're working on that our listeners might be able to jump on? Yeah, um, so at the moment I'm working on my EP, uh, Polaroid Stories Unity, which is set to come out on the 31st of March. And uh, it's really, really cool. Um, you can find um, all the information on I Am Bella Rose at Instagram or uh, Bella Rose.official music on Facebook. I'm like pretty much everywhere. <laughs> mm-hmm. And uh, there's a lot of Bella Roses out there. So you, you find me <laughs> if you see the green icon. Look for the green oh, icon, Twitter. people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Bella, so you pretty much, like, do everything yourself. Like, can you just, like, yeah. tell us what exactly do you do? Do you do production? I know you do, like, singing. So, tell us, because mm. you're multi-talented. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I do pretty much everything. I do the recording process, the songwriting process. I even record the music videos as well mm. and uh, the album cover art as well. I do yes. pretty much everything. Yes. you do it it's, all I do it all so it's, it's very taxing okay sometimes because I'm like I have so much stuff I need to do for this so that's why the EP took so long to come out I worked on it the entire year last year because yeah. it was like so much I needed to do so I'm really really happy that it's coming out now so <laughs> yes absolutely and I'm sure it is worth the wait I have heard some of your tracks and and they're incredible so I know that there are going to be a lot of listeners out there that are are waiting for this EP um me being one of them (laughs) um (laughs) thank you so so much Bella for for joining us and for chatting about um your song with Laurie and Amy stay together um and yeah hopefully we will hear lots more from you lots more music and um beautiful music videos uh, um and all the works um so thank you so so much for joining us no problem thanks for having me